Hello friends, today we will learn about how to create the Azure DevOps Pipeline Templates. So the first question is what is Azure DevOps Step Pipeline Templates? So Azure DevOps Pipeline Template are reusable YAML files that allow you to define common steps, jobs or stages that can be shared and uh, used across multiple pipelines. So what's the benefit of this template? So template helps to maintain the consistency reduce duplication and simplify the pipeline management. So let's create a simple pipeline and then I will create the template files and modify the main pipeline. I will show you step by step how to create the template file and use it. So first we will create the template for steps and then I will create the templates for jobs and in the last I will create the templates for stage. So the, uh, I just log into my DevOps portal. So this is my DevOps project, DevOps CMS. I click on here. Right. So click on the repository. I will create a new repository here. Drop down and create a new repository. So I will give a repository name demo project. demo hyphen project main pipeline so this is my repository name so repository has been created so i click on the more action and then new and create the file here so i will create the file here demo main pipeline click on create and i will paste my template I will paste my YAML file here. So this is my YAML file which I have created. So first is a trigger. So I want to trigger the pipeline when there, whenever I commit make the changes into the main branch. Then I mentioned the pool which I am using the self-hosted zone and in this example I am just using the one stage. So there is only one build stage and I am using the two jobs here. One is the job which I created as a Mac and there is another job which I created the windows right and in these jobs I am using the multiple steps so first step is run the script to uh, print the message hello DevOps engineer from Mac and second is welcome to the DevOps CNS this is a template file demo and third is the multi script line script which is the learn how to create the template right? same in the window. So in both the jobs, I am using the same kind of scripts. Here you can see that I am using the steps here. First step in the Mac job is hello DevOps engineer from Mac. And the next is the let's learn about how to create the template. And same scripts or the same steps I am using in the second job which is for the Windows. Here I add the word window. I add the word Mac. I just add these words. So in order to distinguish the message which is printing. So if you can see the first job is Mac and the second job name is window which depend on the first job. So I'm using the uh, keyword depends on. So it means first Mac job will run and then the Windows job will run. So first I will commit this file and I will create the pipeline and see if the pipeline is working and after that I will make the template file and modify this main pipeline to uh, to see how the templates are working. So I will commit here, commit, right. so let the file just open and I will go to the pipeline, create the new pipeline. So here I will select the repository Azure repo git which is, and this is my project which I have created demo hyphen project pipeline so because I have my YAML file already ready so I will use this YAML file so I will select here the YAML file which is the demo hyphen main pipeline dot YAML file so click on continue so the file has been loaded and I click on run so, so now the uh, job is asking for permission so one option is i will just click here and give the permission here 
to run use this agent pool. The other option is I can go to the project setting. I click on the agent pool, select my self-hosted agent and go to the security. And here, if I click on this plus, it will ask, it is showing this demo hyphen project. So I will add this and this I have permission has been added for this pipeline. So now I go back to the DevOps project pipeline and I will see now the pipeline is running. So I click here. So now this job has been, uh, this pipeline is working fine. So now I will create the uh, template for the steps and I will show you how we can use the same steps in the multiple uh, jobs. Right. So now I will create the another repository template repository and add these steps uh, the templates scripts inside it. So let's go to the repository and just open in a new window. Here I will select the new repository. So new repository name will be demo So new repository name I just give demo hyphen project hyphen template. Click on create button. So now the repository has been created. In this I will create a one new folder in name templates right and if I want to create the file I will create the file also. So I will create the file here is the steps template dot yaml file right so just click on create now the steps temp hyphen template has been created under the template folder so i go to the main pipeline and i will just copy here all the steps here just copy and paste here in the steps so in this you can see the steps template has the keyword steps and then we can add the various scripts because I'm using this template for both the jobs. So I will just remove the here uh, word windows. In the later part, I will show you how to pass the parameter. And so we can have the separate, we can cut, uh, templatize these, even the template files or by using the parameters. So now this file has been created. I will commit it. So now the first step is to refer the template repository not the file but first we have to define which re template repository it need to refer or the load so i will just click on the edit and before trigger i add this piece of code where it will define the resources so resources keyword is i am defining to pass the keyword that repository it will load this repositories so first time repository i am using the demo hyphen project template this is the name or the alias of the template you can give any name you can give your name hyphen template or anything so type is it's a git repository and then next is a name this is the actual name of the repository uh, with project name because i am using the same project devops cns and inside that project i have created this template project template repository demo demo project template repository so uh, here I'm using refin which branch or the uh, tag I need to use. So I'm using the main. So I refer here the main branch. So now the next step is to use the template file. So I will just go into the steps, steps section and enter here. So now I will use the template property inside the steps keyword. So I'm now passing the value. So here the file name so file name is steps hyphen template or yaml it's inside on the templates folder so it is template slash steps hyphen template dot yaml at the rate which repository so the, if i mean if i refer multiple repositories then i have to define here which repository i'm using so i just copy here the repository name and use here right because i'm using this one so i will remove this step here from and the below step. Similarly, I will just 
copy here i will refer this so instead of you writing the same piece of code again and again so i am using the templates to reuse the same piece of code which i mentioned here in the steps hyphen template dot yaml file so in the template yaml so these are the two steps which i am using so i will commit this code and run the pipeline because we have mentioned here trigger that one whenever the changes is made into the main branch so it will run the pipeline so we will commit here the branch pipeline will start so this is the pipeline so if i click here so now the pipeline has been triggered the first job is completed and if you can see here it print here hello devops engineer and in the next it print here the let's learn about how to create the template okay. so now the same it is uh, windows job is running it it is almost completed and it run two steps first uh, script is the hello devops engineer and second is let's learn about how to so now this our pipeline is running with the actor. so now i will just make a little bit modification in the uh, script to pass the parameter so you will understand how the we can pass the parameter and then run the job so in the edit i will enter here so parameters so let's say i operating system mac and same i will pass the parameter here windows so in the steps hyphen template yaml so i will make the changes here to read the parameter and print the message here so here it will be from dollar sign double curly braces parameters dot operating system right so this is a parameter that i am passing from the main pipeline so once i will run the pipeline so it will print hello devops engineer from windows and hello devops engineer for mac for specific jobs so i will commit here so now i will commit this piece also and if we go to the pipeline and see the pipeline should be running so pipeline is running now click on the mac one So if I click here, now see here it is printing now. Hello DevOps engineer from Mac, and the same message will be for the Windows, but it will be Hello DevOps engineer from Windows. So now the Mac job has been completed, and the Windows job has been started. Now if you see here, it is Hello DevOps engineer from Windows, right? So now you have understand how we can create the template file for steps so steps we can reuse in into the different jobs instead of writing again and again and also we learned how we can pass the parameters to those steps so we can uh, you know customize those steps and modify according to our requirement hope this session would be useful for you all template and main pipeline files have been committed in github repository link is mentioned here on the screen I will also provide it into the description. Stay tuned and don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Keep learning. Happy learning.